So you have a list of 25 fuel economies, and I'm going to give you the information for a, a one variable statistics. I won't write all the data down, but uh, let's look at the data, and then we'll uh, answer some of the questions. We find that the mean of the values is 16.604, and the standard deviation is 2.4618. And again, we have 25 pieces of data. Here is our five number summary. We know that the minimum value is 12.85. Q1 is 15.045. The median, and this will help us with some symmetry, is 15.65. So we can see we have a little bit of skewing because this mean and this median are uh, one mile per, uh, one mile per gallon off. Q3 is 18.22 and the maximum is 22.11. And so if we just quick make a little sketch of this, we go down, let's say that this is 10, uh, here's 15, here's 20, here's 25, and we put our 12.85, let's see, would be 1, 2, 3, 4, 12.85 would be probably about here. And the 15 would be about here. And the median of 15.65 is going to be about here. 18, this is 16, 17, 18, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. So 18.22 would be about here. And our 22.11 is going to be about here. So we have a little bit of skewing um, because, again, the mean and the median are not exactly the same. We have this. This is 25% of the data. This is 25% of the data. This is 25% of the data. And this is 25% of the data. So we have a little bit of skewing. Now, you are wanted to find a 95% confidence interval for the mean. So let's find that 95% confidence interval for the mean. <clears throat> and that would be to take our X bar, which is that 16.604 plus or minus, and the T value that is for 24 degrees of freedom is that 2.064 times the sample standard deviation, which is the 2.46183 divided by the square root of 25. And I'm actually going to use my software to find that. That is a T interval. And I have that data in there, and we're doing a 0.95. And so this calculation will end up being 15.588 to 17.62. And then you can look up the data to find out if that's what the fuel economy is supposed to be for that particular vehicle. But I've helped you out in, uh, in some fashion.